Just go to in a second and make it zero. Simply blur in. I can't wait. I'll tell you what. Okay, so you got something like that. Wait a minute. looks pretty nice because what you can do now is you can set a keyframe on the opacity just press T set keyframe and get zero move to one second and make that hundred so come up like that as well as doing that we're gonna add optical flares I mean you can do this with many Titles, so I might show how to do that if if I make a multiple part video of this. So yeah, Control Y. It's not Control Seven. There's an accent there. Whatever. Okay. So yeah, Control Y. Just name this OF. Black. Make the blend mode add. In fact, video copilot optical flares. I'll see if I can try and find the link to the video I used to get optical flares for free. So yeah, once you've got that, you want to go options. And uh, by the way, if you successfully get it installed, it'll contain Pro Presets too. Um, so I want to use this really nice one I recently looked at, Subtool Glint. I think that looks really nice, so I'm going to use that. Um, so yeah, what you want to do now is you just want to position it over the text, kind of like that. And about here, so tell you, no, tell you what, you want to put it over here somewhere. So, to so this, uh, let's see. Uh, position X Y. Um, okay, so here it's gonna come in here. Doesn't matter if it's kind of off. Okay. So it looks like just kind of sweeps over like that. So you also want to set a keyframe on the brightness of zero for here. Um, uh, let's see, two hundred for here. How's it fed? Comes out there. It's going to be a hundred, and then zero. Maybe uh, fifty, and then so exits. Twenty-five. Then, finally, zero. Now you got that. Let's see what it looks like. So I can. It'll look obviously look a lot better if you're actually playing it, but it takes too long to kind of play. So. So say about four and a half. Okay. Oh no, five, sorry. No, yeah, four and a half. Uh, 
Um, yeah, so let's start. So let's just set a keyframe um, on the opacity there. Um, then you want to move over to five and a half and make the opacity zero as well as with the um, what do you call it let's see fast blur that's right so just set a keyframe for your fast blur so just press E here drop down to fast blur click set a keyframe okay so that's for now And yeah, hundred or maybe move to where it actually fades out. So about here we get hundred. Start to do that. So yeah, we've covered quite a nice range of stuff here so you can do that you can do this with multiple titles so if you want to make like a slogan come next so let's say uh, let's see so just do a control D and let's say move it so as soon as that fades out right here put that here Do that with the rest of the thing as well. Um, don't have to worry about the background, right? I'll just continue as it is. So you can just change the text here. So mine is for the knowledge. So if you look right here, that. Right. Just go like that. There you go. That's how you make an intro. Pretty simple stuff, as long as you keep watch, listen, all that. So, yeah. I'll see you in the next tutorial. Just remember to check out the rest of my vids. Subscribe, like, comment, whatever. And I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.